Okay, um, yeah, so, <laughs> I've been on a computer for the last five months, and, um, I recently got a job driving cars and stuff, I got my license situated, and money situated, and so I decided I would get a nice, new, fancy computer, and here we are. We're back five months later, and um, we can play some uh, Fallout New Vegas. Pretty sweet, huh? Uh, we, we can't steal anything from here because that would be stealing. It would be stealing. Um, I don't even remember where we're headed. I know we're headed to New Vegas. <laughs> That's about all I remember. Like these clipboards we can take, grenades would be stealing. I can open a desk. Uh man. Exit. E is for exit. Haven't played in so long. But I've forgotten how. Alright. Well, what were we doing? We're trying to find a way to get into New Vegas. Is this guy practicing fighting? Are you are you practicing fighting? Let me guess. You got work for me, right? Uh, no, not well, you're yet. too late. I just quit the bounty trade. Mm -hmm. As soon as I pick up some caps that Dottrio owes me, I'm out of this scrapyard. Now look at that. His face. Are you supposed to be famous or something? Well, shit. Feel free to stick a knife in the old ego. Thought I made a name for myself around here. I'm new Guess that's here. as good a reason as any to quit this stinking trade. No. No glory. No easy money, no women, and no glory. Did you mention shit. no glory? I'd settle just for the women. Would you? Why does Dar Datry owe you caps? Because I killed a couple of marks for him. That's why. You ever hear of Jackson? Or Night Terror? No. No. Of course you didn't. Because they crossed paths with Lil Buster. Bam. Dead. Finished. Over. See, well. somebody gives me a job, I do it. Maybe I complain a little here and there, but my shit gets done. How long have you been a bounty hunter? Oh, shit. I don't know. Gotta be at least a month. Longer than I last in most jobs. Uh-huh. You worked a lot of different trades? Oh, yeah. A lot. Like, before I was a bounty hunter, I worked as a caravan guard. You'd think that was a cakewalk, right? No, because I've seen those blow up Crazy before. Crazy bastards expected me to wake up at dawn. Forget it. It's about two hours after this guy hits the sack. And I need at least 10, 12 hours of sleep to do my job. Price of excellence. Um, yeah, okay. I've been known to hunt a few bounties myself. Well, hey, field's wide open now that I'm gone. Probably lots of people looking to get in once they hear I quit. I quit. What are you going to do now? Simple. Going to make myself some easy money. I got a plan. Once I get my cash from Daughtry, I'm going to head on over Is to Gamora. Is this guy tweaking or something? Cards. There's not as many people playing at Gamora, so that means I've got better odds of winning big. That, that's, not how, figured out. that's not how that works, but okay. Why did you quit the trade? See, I thought the bounty hunting trade would be easy money. Easy it money. It's hard work, so screw it. <laughs> also, I ran into this mark who was a little too tough for me. I mean, I could have taken him. But, but with you this didn't. guy, might have cost me some bad burns or an ass rape. Uh, I'm well, all for risking my geez. life, but I'm a little sensitive about my asshole. I did... <sighs> Next time you see me, maybe I'll be rolling in a shitload of caps, right? <laughs> Must you always be so offensive? Wonder glue? Can I even carry all this crap? Pfft. Spatula? I don't, do I even need all this crap? Is the better question. <sighs> Got nowhere to put it. I was supposed to talk to somebody here, but it's been so long since I've played this. I don't remember. Let's just talk to everyone. I'm Bitter Root, First Recon. You got a reason to talk to me? No, not 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 really. You have an unusual name. Start trouble? Or do you really not know where I got that name? I I really I really don't know. You can tell me. No. What's it matter to you? Why does everybody care so much about other people's business? Hey, you're an NPC. Why? And leave me be. 
Well, don't be a dick. Or I'll start calling you Sergeant... No, I won't call you that. What the heck? Is that really a hula doll? I can't pick it up. That's sad. What's that? Pork and beans. He's sleeping. Bubble gum. Sure. Um, it's midnight. Let's sleep for a couple hours. I don't even know who that is. All right. Oh, hey, what's up, Hello. dude? Hello. What can I do for you? I don't know. Oh, I guess I already. Okay, tell me about first the recon. Finest sniper outfit in the whole NCR. If you need a bullet put into a target's eye from 800 yards away. Why are you away, wearing you lipstick like us. that? Some of my team aren't without their share of scars, though, like Betsy and Sterling. What's wrong with Betsy? Cook, cook. One of the fiends ambushed her and ten of spades. They both managed to escape, but not before Cook, cook raped her. Betsy <sighs> shrugged it off like it was nothing, but her behavior keeps getting worse. Always making passes at every woman who wanders by. What? It's inappropriate for anyone at first recon to behave that way. I could discipline her, but I'd rather she get medical help. I'm sorry, but this game suddenly became at least PG rated. PG 13? What's between PG 13 and R? I don't know. I thought there was something. I can talk to Betsy about getting medical help for her trauma if you want. I'd appreciate it. As her CEO, I could order her to get help. This guy over here, look at his face. Idea. He's not doing anything. What happened to Sterling? Corporal Sterling was an NCR Ranger until he was captured by the Legion. They tortured him pretty badly. He wasn't able to be a Ranger after that, but his eyes are still sharp, so I had him transferred to First Recon. All right. Well, goodbye. No, uh, not to kill, didn't yes. want to click on that. Whatever it takes to get the job done. I would like to say goodbye now. Carry on. You, my wayward son. All right. Morning. Oh, morning. Oh. Um. Yeah. Just walk through me. Oh. That's cool. Howdy. Name Sterling. First recon. Can't say I've seen you before. I'd remember if I had. How does that hat stay on your head? You're right. We've never met. Memory for faces. Landmarks and such too. Comes with practice, that's all, and a lot of scouting from place to place. Mm-hmm. Uh, um. Pff, okay. Goodbye. Always a pleasure. Keep yourself safe. I gotta talk to Betsy. <laughs> the itsy Betsy spider. Well. Who said that. Nobody said that. They're right behind me. and things <clears throat> I had started playing uh, Fallout 3 which is pretty much just the same kinda so I don't want to steal a pack of cigarettes I will pick up random magazines I suppose though is there a Betsy in here what is that and why is it floating Steal bottle caps. I'll. No. Oh man, you know what else I've forgotten how to do? Salesman Weekly. Okay. Morning. Morning. Man, Doc can't really fix me up right the last time I got shot. He's the man to see if you need some fixing. I need some fixing. Hey, excuse me. We won't go quietly. The Legion can count on that. The Legion. Oh, I forgot. Oh my god, dirty water. Uh, oh, sorry. Don't burn me. I can't find this Betsy person. Where are you, Betsy? Well, this must be where the doctor is. Although, I don't see anyone in here. Ooh. 
Nice. Medical clipboards, which are pretty much useless to me. I have a... Oh. Hello. Hello. Alright, so it does show me on the, my map where things are. That's Lieutenant Gorobets. Gorobets? I don't know. Same people. And a spades. Hey. Talk to me. Hey, my man. Ten of spades. First recon sharpshooter at your s service. Yeah? I heard about what happened to Corporal Betsy. The LT told you about that? Shit, man. That's sh shit. Tell me what happened. Not that I it really want to know. My fault. See, I was knocked out when it happened. The b big guy sneaked up on us. I let b b Betsy down. Shit sound like yeah. LT. I should have woken up. I shouldn't have gotten knocked out in the first place. That shit was my fault. I don't want to talk about it anymore, all right? She's my goddamn partner. See, we work in pairs. Sniper. We spot for each other. R watch each other's backs. Nobody r wanted to work with me. They said I was too green. But you look kind of tan. Hair. Shit, you don't even know how big a d d deal that is. She trusts her life to the newbie. And I sit here and let her get raped by that piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, the LT shouldn't have brought that shit up. Not with civvies, anyway. Ain't right. Are you all right? Oh, yeah. Fine. Just a little st st stutter. Had it since I was a kid. Doesn't stop me from kicking ass. Wow, you can be a dick or you cannot be a dick. Damn right. <laughs> right. Um. All right. Yeah, I'll see you around. I think I pretty much know he's a sniper, so I just have to find this Betsy. Where are you, Betsy? This kind of shows me that she's over here. I guess she's in the sniper thing right now. This is the quest log or the quest? There we go. No. That's just a random CR trooper. Oh my gosh. Data. World map. Quests. I don't hurt anymore. Show location. Oh, she's, she's behind me. All right, let's go find her. Now it's showing me her location. It was showing me a different quest location. Also, check that out. Um, <laughs> my new computer stats. I should probably, uh, let's see. Um, it's got an i7. GTX 750 Ti, 16 gigabytes of RAM. You know, something that will let me play this game without... Oh man, I must have walked right by. So wait. Bitterroot. Is Betsy like lying down or something? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. You should get medical help for your trauma. The lieutenant's been talking to you, hasn't he? Look, I don't need a head doctor. I'm first recon, damn it. Damn you it. You don't see the others crying about every little bruise and scrape, do you? People are worried about you. Um, this seems more likely. I already told you that I'm fine. I don't need a head doc. People ought to mind their own business. Yeah, try not to get killed. Well, that's good advice. Hello. 
So this tells me to talk to other people to help her. But they just walked away, so. Serious things happening. Who is this? You're just a random trooper. Oh. You remember me, right? T ten of spades, first recon. Yeah. I'm trying to convince Corporal Betsy to go see a doctor. Any ideas? Oh, but because of what that fuck Cook Cook did? Well, well it's not not the same thing, but the, Doc Kusanagi helped me with my stutter. The, the, the Doc has a clinic north of here. Can't miss it. You should talk to Bitteru, too. He's been to see the Doc, too. Thanks for the tip. No, no problem. Yeah, I'll see. Uh, so Hello. Corporal Bitterroot is the one we gotta talk to now. Where is he? Oh, he's over here. How do you even get in here? Where is the door? Hey, what's up? I didn't think you'd be back. What's this about? I was trying to get Corporal Betsy to go see a doctor. I heard you saw Asengi Usanagi yourself. Ten of Spades really ought to keep his mouth shut, but he's right. There are a lot of things in my past I just couldn't leave behind. It helps. A little. Well, more than a little. Betsy ought to pay a visit to Usanagi since it can't hurt none. Alright, goodbye. So now who do I speak with? So I guess we look at the quest. Look at the quest. Uh, what? Speak with Corporal Sterling. Howdy. What brings you back? Uh, you know that whole. Any ideas on how to convince Corporal Betsy to go see a doctor? It's a pride thing with her, and totally unnecessary. I mean, look at me. I was Ranger Sterling until the Legion got through with me. I was bitter, but if I kept my mouth shut, the NCR would have discharged me and sent me home. Instead, I asked if there was still a place for me. I had to prove I could still handle a gun alongside all the recruits. Look at me now. First recon, look at me now. Strong. You tell Betsy that. All right, I'll try. Always a pleasure. Keep yourself safe. I will as soon as I find her. Where'd she go? Yeah? Yeah? The rest of First Recon all agree that you should go see Dr. Yusanagi. This was none of their business. Or yours. You got no right to talk to people behind my back about this. Tennis Spade says his stuttering got better because of Usanagi. He got better? If he says so. Anyway, Tennis Spades is a good kid. Maybe I ought to listen to him for once. I'm guessing the other two had similar things to say. Alright, consider me convinced. I'll go see Usanagi. Yay! You can tell the lieutenant that I caved. And thanks. You're welcome. How about a date? No, I'm just kidding. Tell Lieutenant Gora Betts that Corporal Betsy will start receiving treatment. Yeah, try not to get killed. I will do that. Is that him? Hey, what can hey. I do for you? I convinced Corporal Betsy to go get help from Dr. Yusanagi. Yes, the others in the squad said you'd come to them about her. It's a start, but let's hope she sticks with the treatment as long as it's necessary. I'm afraid she'll ditch Usanagi early if she feels it's taking too long. She won't want to look bad in the eyes of the rest of First Recon. Mm -hmm. Do me a favor and let Usanagi know Corporal Betsy is coming. I'd like to make sure the medical clinic has time for her. Okay. It's the New Vegas Medical Clinic. Carry on. Well, I guess we have a destination now. Oh, excuse me. Where is this place? M does not equal map. Oh, that is literally in New Vegas. Okay. And one day I'll remember that I just have to hit tab to get out of that menu. Okay. Okay. So, um, I guess that's a pretty good stopping point. Um, hmm. uh, I guess that's an episode. And I guess I'll see you 
in the next one.